What's up, El Segundo? I'm Natasia Gascon, and we're kicking off Native American Heritage Month here at Library Park with an amazing performance by Indigenous artists. Let's go see what's up. Former El Segundo resident Shelley Morningsong and her husband, Fabian Fontanelle, are award-winning recording and performing artists from the Zuni Pueblo of New Mexico representing their native cultures and traditions of the Cheyenne, Zuni, and Omaha tribes. They've returned to El Segundo to celebrate Native American Heritage Month with a music and dance performance in partnership with the El Segundo Library. Actually, this is about a year in the making. Um, I happened to have seen a post from Sarah Taylor. Uh, I think it was on the Community Network or the Parents Network about a year ago, and it just kind of mentioned about her mother and her father and what they do. And I felt, God, this would be a great opportunity, a great experience for the community. So I took that information, I forwarded it on to our Arts and, Car uh, Arts and Culture Committee, um, as well as Julie Todd um, and Sam Lee from our, our Cultural Arts Administrator, and they made this all happen. Um, and I just think it's a, a really great opportunity here for uh, the community to get to see something they probably have never seen before. I love El Segundo. I uh, raised all my children here and they went to all the El Segundo schools and now our granddaughter Brianna is at uh, El Segundo High School her freshman year and so um, yes I have a very deep connection to El Segundo I've seen so many changes in this town when I come back I always see something you know change and um, just so happy always to come back you know to this community so well it's just an awesome uh, wonderful invitation through uh, the library the people that are in charge of the library here for the entertainment that they put on and provide and we were approached by them uh, several months ago and it became a reality and we're just uh, Shelly and I are just so thankful and happy to be here and uh, Shelly's a recording artist she's a contemporary native recording artist and I am a men's northern traditional dancer and Shelly is part Cheyenne, northern Cheyenne by way of Lame Deer, Montana and I am Zuni Omaha by way of Zuni Pueblo, New Mexico. We came here from Zuni Pueblo, New Mexico, my husband Fabian and myself and uh, we came out to El Segundo to present um, our traditional and contemporary music for the community, our dancing, singing, flute playing, and a little bit of education um, to help celebrate Native American Month here in November, for November. <laughs> To, to keep bringing awareness to people to uh, who we are and where we come from, we're a very, very proud race of people, very proud race of people, and um, we're just so thankful to be able to, to do what we do, to carry on the way we do, and to share also at the same time uh, some of our, our traditions, our culture. They go back thousands and thousands of years, but what we present is contemporary Native music, Shelly's writing, her singing, her songs, and I share traditional hand drum songs as well, but what we share in dancing, in the dancing perspective, is uh, social dances, and that's what we share. Yeah, we saw, I think, um, you know, a representation of a culture that is uh, sometimes gets lost in the larger American, uh, you know, society, so we wanted to introduce our son to different cultures, expose him to it. And I think the, the natural song and dance is a great part of, it's part of our culture, it's part of other people's culture, so 
I think it's that's a good that's, way to connect yeah. with other cultures for kids especially to you know be part of it and understand that it's good to respect all cultures and beliefs. The, the more we can uh, introduce them to all kinds of music, dance, culture, traditions, hopefully the more well-rounded it will be. So this is why we're you know we're here today. I think it's a great story. This this if you look at their story here of Shelley and Fabian is that it, it came full circle. Uh, to raise a family here, go outside, and then come back uh, with an opportunity to, to show what life is all about for them, I think is a great moment. And it's important, again, in the community for us to understand that people come from all different walks of life, uh, they come from all different backgrounds, and it's important to celebrate what those are because in the end, it doesn't matter where you come from or where you are, when you're living here, you're all part of the same community. Well, there you have it, folks. We had a lot of fun here at today's Native American celebration, and we can't wait to see more in the future. For El Segundo Media, I'm Natasia Gascon. Thank you.